Today we are going to see how to do science fair project from scratch to finish. This video has three parts. First part how to do basic research to select your topic. Second making the trifold board. Third designing the content. As you can see the size comparison with my son of the trifold board. Now let's see in detail how to do science fair project from scratch. So for researching the topic I went to our trusty Google, typed in topics for science fair project and boom I landed on science buddies website. This website was amazing because it listed down all the projects that can be done. Find all the resources that is required in one go. Uh, which your child is most comfortable and of course interested in. A few days ago my son watched a Mark Robbers world's largest elephant toothpaste experiment in uh, YouTube and he was very interested and wanted to try it out by himself. So this was the topic that we selected because it, it was chemistry related and of course easy to do at home. So researched about it and uh, found out the ingredients or the components required to do this project and yes that's the topic elephants toothpaste experiment. Now let's see some tricks and tips how to ace your project during presentation. So the most important factor that determines our success is topic. So choose a topic that is interesting and challenging that should gel with the category given by the school. For example, uh, for us it is chemistry in everyday life. So the experiment that you take should justify the topic that is given by your school. And of course your child should be interested and enthusiastic. This will definitely reflect in the result because the way they explain it matters the most. So the second tip is research. I cannot overemphasize the importance of understanding the back information the only way to do this is read 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 the child should spend quality time in understanding this uh, ingredients the concepts behind it science behind it and understand what really happens and what did not so the only way uh, the child will understand is through reading so this will really reflect when you talk to the child it just flows through them so this gives the auditor that the, re the child really spent time in understanding the concept which is the the main purpose of keeping any science fair is to check whether the child really understood and participated the, uh, in the experiment. Third tip is application. Now you have done your research.